Cho cho boy. Hey. Cho boy. Hey. Cho cho boy. Hey. DJ hey. boy anyu. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you know what time it is. It's a lovely Wednesday evening. <laughs> and I'm blushing because I have a fine girl in front of me. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and the show is a late night celebrity show. My name is Foster Romanus. And I have, you just saw her performance. I mean, the vivacious, the vicious, the hey, courageous, the yasanta. Also, tighten it then. Me, your friend, me, ya, a bitch, mwa, mosa. Uh huh. What's your baby, him, man? Bantam, masa, na, hini, nana, ma, me, ya, a bitch, mwa, mosa. Bako, pe. And our tenancy, I'm going to pull Bob, but your Bob, you're my eye. Bantam, masa, na, hini, nana, ma, me, ya, a bitch, mwa, mosa. Bako, pe. AKA. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so there you have it, my guest is Yaya. Yeah, yeah. Join us on WhatsApp is 020-222054. And you can ask her anything you want to ask her. She is Yaya. Yeah. But before then, hmm, what do you know about spirits? What do you know about spirits? I'm not talking about spiritual spirits. I'm talking about spirits as in drinks. Hey, okay, what am I drink for you? In that spirit, dear. So I'm talking about in some spirits. What do you know about spirits? So when you drink it, mm -hmm. it feels like you have spirits in you. Do you have any favorite spirit? Uh, no. You no. don't? Actually, I right, don't. Right, so before we so continue. Comment some for me. I'll, I'll do that. Let's hey. just watch this one. And I mean, it's all about all you need to know about spirits in Iraq. Okay, so there you have it. All you need to know about spirit, the type of spirit, how it's made and what it's made from, etc., etc. And also let me remind you that Entertainment Achievers Award is also upcoming live on CTTV at 7 p.m. And uh, expect to be dazzled and thoroughly entertained at the maiden edition of the Entertainment Achievers Award 2021. So it's happening live at 7 p.m. on the 27th of March, that's on Saturday, yeah, Ebe, yeah, at 7 p.m. live on City TV, ETV Ghana, and DGN TV. Okay, are you ready? ready. Charlie, the song you sang at the at the, the three music hours branch, you know. No mami, running. Yeah, mommy, kakra on kakra. There's no running. Oh, there's no hiding. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. mm, 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 We've mm, got mm. to be bold, stand up tall, and change the world. Oh, 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 boy. Hey. Cho cho boy. Hey. Cho boy. Hey. I was talking hey now as a warrior. Warrior, someone can hey. Hey. So we are romantic into it. Oh yes, thank you, thank you. Cho boy. Hey. Ha! That's you know what I'm saying. We are more at the table. Ah, that's right. No matter. Me too. Me too. Warrior home. Hey, hey. Me a prayer warrior. <laughs> and it's ritual warfare. No? Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, bear in mind that the Ghana Beverage Awards also on the corner very soon is going to be live here on ETV Ghana as well. So the Ghana Beverage Awards, log on to www.ghanabeverageawards.com to nominate your favorite and vote for your favorite beverage to win that prestigious award as well. Yeah, so now I have Yaya who just gave us that dazzling one. Mm. Hey. <laughs> 
Pastor, how are you? I'm fine. How are you too? Do they know we know each other? No, I'm now about to tell them. Oh, wonderful. That Yaya is actually my schoolmate. She is my no reality show. No mates like the same year. Don't make it look no, like I'm... schoolmates. We're in the same school together. Oh, yes, school, not classmates. You yeah. Know, it went for the same reality show. Stars of the future. Yes. I actually opened the door for you. Hey. Yeah, hey. yeah. <laughs> 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 Door openness. Come on, somebody. Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> so that's where, that's how we, we know each other. We've been friends for Who's a while. Who's about Stars of the Future? Really? Uh, thanks for reminding me. Oh, I remember me. you won Stars of the Future some years back, mm -hmm. and you know, I mean, we knew you as Bertha, and then you changed to Yaya. Mm -hmm. I've always wanted to ask you why you did that. Um, so before Stars of the Future, I was using Yaya mm. as my stage name. Okay. So I released a single before I came for Stars of the Future, Independent Woman. Yeah, in Chahun video, did, but it was doing quite well in Kumasi. And then I came to Accra to do Stars of the Future. Okay. And when we entered the competition, I, they asked me for a name. You know, you, they asked for yeah, a single name. name. I was like, hey, I use Yaya already. Should I stick to that name? I was like, no, um, I should stick to Bertha because primary JSS, senior high school, everybody's known me yeah. as Bertha. Okay. And if I want votes, for the votes, yeah, I have to make sure people know that it's me. So I went with Bertha so I can get the votes. And by God's grace, I won. That's one. Congratulations Thank again. You. you. Thank you. Thank you. Theater, that's enough. May yet faithful with the chairman Kwame. I'm saying maybe it's time for me to go back to my name, Yaya, because the BIFS here, Kono, Bertha, no, Kwa, and does yeah. that have effect on your brand at that time or on your career at that time when you changed the name? Um, I fully changed with Kai. And Kai really Kaio, Kaio. Mm. Is it? Kaio, Wado, Kaio, Wado, Kaio. Namine, Wai, Yeah, in the wedding. Now, baby, I'm a common. And I fully changed to Yaya. Um, it took a while because Nanko Fool, who say a better corner, even now, some people still get confused. Uh -huh. yeah. But majority of people now know that there's a Yaya, and Yaya is here to stay. Internationally, Yaya is doing way, way better than Bertha mm. would have. Mm. So that's a good thing. It's really impacting it. It will make an impact, and it's been positive. Okay. So that's something I'm really grateful for. So that means that you only changed because you were using Yaya then before Bertha, and you thought you had to go back to, even though Bertha was doing well. Um, Bertha was doing well, but as I said, because of where I was thinking of going, international, mm -hmm. doing festivals, um, Bertha didn't represent my roots as much. Okay. Yes, Yaya depicts Africa, Ghana. Mm -hmm. You know, it makes you want to know who the person is. Bertha sure. sounds more foreign. More foreign. You know, and around that time, no, me when it starts to feature we me call interview. It will be be will be I say, oh, hello, Becca. I'm like, no. Mm. The presenters will be correcting them all the time. Okay. So I was like, okay, maybe it's time for me to change. That's to true. my name. That's yeah, true. yeah. That's true. People are thinking because other people change their name to local, that's why you uh, you also did that. Oh, David, David, David. As a whole copy. Oh, David, David. Did they also change your tone, your sound, your voice? No, not your voice, your sound, like as in your genre. Um, Yes, to some extent. Because my focus has been doing like song to mm -hmm. meet the international, international. standard. In t um, already when I started, I was working in that direction, but it's just my name and my brand wasn't matching okay. that okay. so when i changed the name and the branding the look mm -hmm. then everything just fell in place so the sound hasn't really changed okay yeah in terms of response in terms of acceptance i mean looking at the trend now on the airwaves you know the kind of songs that are being played as compared to the songs that you're doing what would you say is the position now in terms of acceptance mm. and all well, radio play, the kind of music I do hasn't really gotten a lot of radio play recently. Mm -hmm. But I remember when I released, um, I released uh, this song, Am I Kai um, Incredible? Around that time, 
they play they used to play a lot of um soul music yeah, you know mm -hmm. those mm -hmm. high life slow high life music um but now things have changed a bit mm. the upbeat you songs know, are the ones you know. trending now but kudos to all the um, presenters that are playing music like mine god bless you all please keep playing them we appreciate you we see you we love you ain't he acceptance in the ghana for dominion nepal um, I w I'm not even going to sit here and lie about it because most of the people that listen to my music stream or buy are from Ghana. Oh, really? Yes. Yes. So that should tell you that people love what we do. It's just that on radio, it doesn't reflect. But when you go and look at, you know, behind the scenes, yeah, that's what's happening. Wow, that's even surprising. my following on social media, mainly from Ghana. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's surprising. But why are you surprised? Because you're a big fan of my music too. Yes, but <laughs> <laughs> we, we are saying that because of the, like I'm saying, the radio and what we, we see out yes. there. Because I know that's how, you know, people are selected to play on in the shows. Like, you know, your guest contracts and all. Yes, when you might hit your Beyonce and <laughs> most of the time, most songs in your new one, like what we say is that you can't use the hit factor mm. like how we categorize other hit songs yeah. in quotes you know hey, so then you are like hey are they really getting the support are they really getting the you know what i'll say is um s well i'll speak for myself mm. i do get a lot of corporate events so that's where my energy has been like if i'm not doing festivals outside ghana or africa then I'm here doing corporate events. So if mm. you go to my YouTube, for instance, you see I sang the national anthem. That was marvelous. I was like, oh, wow. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I like your boldness <laughs> when you actually sing it. Like your vo oh my God. Oh. Hey, hey. My continue, continue. <laughs> <laughs> um, so those, and I, I think that's that's just one of the corporate events that came out for people to see because mm. sometimes they don't want to publicize their events. Yeah, that's true. So we do a lot of corporate events. Well, low key. I'm so low key and also <coughs> on that money note, I'll go for a quick <laughs> commercial <laughs> break. Everybody love money. You hear that thing? Yeah. And to, uh, do the do the break for me. And we are not me at all. Thank you so much for tuning in. And you're you're here with me, Yaya and Foster. We are going to get some money. We'll be right back. <laughs> Superstar. Mm -hmm. This is the voice of Jaja. Jaja. Sana. Hini. Bantama Sana. What's the name of Nana. Bantama Sana. Hini. Nana. Mami Yeduchumwa. No, son. Ladies and gentlemen, the number is 0202 And it's still Yaya here. Let's talk about three music brunch and your performance. Oh, yeah took over the internet mm. like you were like whoa mm, there was something you. so new refreshing I mean first off it's kind in a way yes <laughs> how did you get that what informed that uh, and mm. like I mean because we know it's a performance yeah you just dressed hold a mic and come and, and sing. why why did you decide to do that um so first of all how it started I have an album out called Ago. Mm -hmm. So last Which we'll year, we'll be talking about very soon. Yeah. So Monsieur that played is actually from that album. Okay. And um, last year, when we were doing the album listening, before going to perfect the album, um, I was speaking to one of the people I invited. His name is Beat Menace Kofi, and I was telling him like this song, No Running. I really wanted to either open an award show or you know those sporting events, World Cup, and mm -hmm. things like that. He's like, look, I have a perfect person to call for this. So he got in touch with Sadiq of Three Music Awards, and he drove from wherever he was. Like, we waited for, I think, 40 minutes or one hour. And when he came, we played the song. He's like, look, this is a song for Three Music Awards. Wow. So initially, it was supposed to open for last year, but because of COVID, mm -hmm. that couldn't happen. And see, this year, he got in touch and said, we need it for this year. So we, we have a women's branch and we want you to perform for the women's branch. And we discussed initially, we're thinking like a huge number mm -hmm. for like just female dancers to come and perform with me. So finally we came down to the number 16. So with the performance, you saw 16 mm -hmm. females yeah. and it was a female that directed it. And we had two female choreographers. 
So wow. it was all female. So and I remember meeting in time. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, very important. But almost um, more, it's right now almost supporting. Mm. Um, so you can't can do it that us. You can't do it that us. <coughs> Continue. <laughs> we'll discuss that later. And <laughs> 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 see, um, yeah, yeah, discussion with three music awards team. You know, we brainstormed. Mm -hmm. We suggested a few things because it's a virtual concert. So we wanted to do something that's different. Yeah. And um, yeah, just different from what we keep seeing every year. And I'm glad that I was invited for such a, a, a great um, groundbreaking mm -hmm. opportunity mm -hmm. as that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have a background, a background in this in performing arts. Yes, theater, mm -hmm. dance, music. Did that play a role, like in that one, like the fact that you had that training? A lot, a lot, because um, I did musical theater. Okay. Before even I went to um, level 100, I was in Beauty and the Beast. I did Ugly Duckling, um, Sound of Music, and a whole bunch of other musicals. And after school, too, I joined Riverman Productions. Yeah. And we've done a lot of musicals as well. So um, I know about putting great ideas together on stage, not just holding a mic to sing, which can be good mm -hmm. and perfect. But my year, a number of times, I wanted to spice it up. And I'm a catcher some year corporate events. Mm -hmm. They have seen this kind of performance live before. Oh, wow. For well, we have no. Uh -huh, but on mainstream, like television and stuff like that, Ubiya Shedem Hun Semi Yebibisa. In Tiglitz Awards, my Yebibisa Momo, there's this other men's award, or Moye, um, Emmy Awards. Uh huh. Mm. My performance, Bisa Momo. So something that I do, but it's just after people have. Yeah, it's because most of the time, the people who do these songs, mostly when they are to perform you hear them they come oh, oh, oh. Mic. so sometimes it feels like uh, it's quite edgy mm. you know but with this one if it's like on a live stage with live audience yeah we'll be on our toes to you know actually enjoy it so that said let's go performing as and you how many years since you completed Ooh, i completed in 2014. it was like seven years now yeah. so uh, I, I, we'll, we'll get there <laughs> <laughs> Is there any plan mm -hmm. to sort of give back to the school with where you are with it? And what so would that be? Not to the school, but to talent. Um, because I think whatever I went to learn in University of Ghana is so that I can better my society with it. Mm. You know, and just coming back to the school to concentrate wouldn't be ideal at the moment. Okay. So what I do is I also train younger um, musicians, whether rappers or singers, either professional or, or amateurs, I help groom them. And I've been doing that since 2017. Yes. But you can be in the music department of the School of Performing Arts, teaching vocal or voice, voice doing voice training, training or something. That's also a, a way of giving back to the school. In the moment, time won't allow me. How? But you're helping with others. So oh why so don't no, you? No, quarterly. That's the there's a one-off thing you one do. One-off thing. So every quarter. Because, you know, music, too, is very, like, stressful. It, it demands your time. And I'm a productions with Uncle Ebo White. So I, I need time for my work as well. And then to be of service to mankind. So <laughs> then they are putting their school aside. They oh. are not helping their school, school now. School, only hear me. I'm there for them all the time. Yeah. Because, so this is what I learned, and I've had this achievement i want to use this achievement to Sir. help okay then probably they negotiate to know where you i'll discuss help. it with a few of my lecturers from there and see so that means you've not thought of giving back to your school um we have discussed it before but not with the school with a few of the lecturers that's why i was saying say it's, it's demanding mm. and i know say you're demanding see, i don't want to go and start something that i can't finish you know because oh quiet you go in fully and you do all you can to help uh -huh. So when I'm fully equipped, I will do that. Diplomatic answer. <laughs> 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 okay, <laughs> But then you, you help rap arts, you know. I mean, you have a way of connecting with your audience in between your performances. You rap, you you know. Play instruments. You play the xylophone. Like yeah. she plays the xylophone. Do you know how? Patient, <laughs> you have to wait <laughs> to play a 16-piece or 32-piece 
Bambu. That's <laughs> a <laughs> bambu. <laughs> How I, you learn that, like, school you know how performing arts. You learn from the school of performing arts. Music department. You see, and you don't want to give back to them. Oh, and you say, you see, <laughs> there are people who also don't have that opportunity. Mm -hmm. And I have to say this, that there are a lot of lecturers who are also given back to or given to students there who okay. have, you know, paid their fees to learn. There are some people who are not that fortunate to have access into, like, the School of Performing Arts. Some people want to do short courses, but they don't have that available. Mm -hmm. And I remember when I went into Stars of the Future, even before Stars of the Future, I was looking for opportunities to prepare myself for what I have ahead of me, my music journey. And I didn't want to start, like, a four-year course immediately. I wanted something short, but there was nothing around. So mm -hmm. after looking at all those things, I'm like, there are some people who won't have the time to do four years. You know, so why yeah. can't I be that for them? So I don't have to be in the school of performing arts to, to actually impact people's lives. You know, and I'm doing that, helping young people, and I think it's so fulfilling. Like, mm. one of the best experiences I have in my life is sitting there teaching them and knowing that they are improving on their gifts. Have you taught any mainstream? Lady J. Lady mm. J, yes. I'm I've helped sure. Lady J before. Um, I think it was two years ago. Yeah. Okay, then the rest are all just... Yeah, the rest, I mean, some of the mainstream acts, I usually just give them tips as I meet them because OBE need time, sir. Mm. It's just tips that when you have time, you just, you know, work out things on your own. Yes. All right, so Mika, I'm going to give you some tips actually on stuff you need for some things. That said, I'm going for a quick commercial break. <laughs> <laughs> You're a superstar. Ladies and gentlemen, we're still tuned in to the Late Night Celebrity Show. My guest is Yaya. Some of you messages here, and this one says, Yaya, you are so talented. I, I love your music so much. This Thank is from you. Dombre inside Takaradi. And Abrokwa is saying, you know what? Just tell her I love her. Thank you. Only her voice. Me Darcy. About <laughs> your voice. <laughs> what have you done? <coughs> so you're talking about tips. Yes. So I want to be a musician like some few tips of what to do and what not to do okay so the first thing i'll say is that always think of yourself as a vocal athlete and that's why you played running they be won't say athletes be i know and sana obe kwa kwe ye ni mi kana say say if it's a footballer the person will go and play the match they have to warm up <laughs> so every time you're going to sing or perform you need to warm up and you need to also train your voice <coughs> so you need to know, like, do skill exercises, do ear training, because you want to make sure that you don't go off when you're singing. And you, ha you have to know the things that you have to eat and things you shouldn't eat. Ain't you say, no? It means all petulled stuff, like ukasamete. So, upe cook. Upe chilled cook. And then, like, near my chili. When your children call the ice big goom, in it? Confess your can, sins. Can you give that tip? Confess <laughs> your sins. <laughs> <laughs> so all those things don't help. Mm. And they'll do all better fun as a song. Or they, they sleep in AC. It's not good for your voice. Mm. Uh -huh. So you, you have to know the kind of voice you have to your tone. And that, so we all need some background. You need a vocal trainer to guide you. And that's what I'm here for. How long does it take to train someone? What I do in Vocal Hub is that I give you the tools to help you train on your own. So what I do is six weeks training, mm. quarterly, to be an episode, sign it up again, uh, whether for the public or private class, I got you. So, ha, 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 but you ha, need to ha. constantly practice. So even if you are done with your short course, whatever course you're doing, whichever trainer you're working with, you need to have a calendar for your training. I always say this because that's what's helped me. I decided that, okay, at 2 p.m. every day, I only have one rest day. 2 p.m. every day, I'm practicing for at least two hours. Yeah, singing or yeah, I yeah. do my warm-ups, then I pick a song that I'm practicing for probably the week, and then I train, make sure that I get it to perfection. So every week, at least you have a new song that you've learned. You know, because you can't just sit there and say you're a singer and you don't put practice in at all. Can you prove yourself? But it takes so practice and time. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Do, do, re, do, do, re, mi, re, do, 
do re mi fa mi re do do re mi fa so fa mi re do do re mi fa so la so fa mi re do do re mi fa so la ti la so fa mi re do do re mi fa so la ti do ti la so fa mi re do then you move to another um is it a semitone up yes and you just work yourself your way up yes minyobiana yengo hey you want to try <laughs> okay i'll give you a simple one do re do mi do fa do so do la do ti do do this simple <laughs> do, do do yes do re do re do mi do mi do fa do fa <laughs> wash it wash it no yanko yanko do re do re if you want you can stay low okay so let's go low do re to it do re okay do re do mi do mi do fa do so so do la do la do ti do ti what's the sound do 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord <laughs> do do come for vocal change i have I to you. come man yeah. i have to come i feel there are so many yeah and to be jai chilled what i don't know you just drink look look warm or you see room temperature uh-huh now before a performance or say necra even with your your speaking mm -hmm. there are things you have to stay away from yeah. so that you can have a clean tone i try and to all that. i don't eat pork that's not part. <laughs> 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 That's not part. But spicy stuff mm. before you get you your engagement or something, and you're good. Oh, back and go back to pork. Oh, and the diobe to me feel free. Okay, carbonated mm -hmm. drinks. Maybe a week to your performance or engagement. Don't take them. And I be at three days too. Don't take them. Well, be honest and you're reactive. I can drink it before. Not chilled. How do you drink carbonated drink not chilled? Ah, but you want to, you want to polish your voice. Do re. <laughs> so Do it. it's a sacrifice because you know what you want, and, and when it pays off, because when you are singing or when you are rapping and your voice is clean and you are getting that applause, you know that you put in the work. Mm. What about so going a lot of to the stand at the beach and being ha 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 ha? And also you have to. It's not just about doing it, but doing it effectively. Because so yes, Sana will do so voice ah. Obi will him how to get it back. So I'll just advise is say get someone to train you or guide you so that you just you just don't jump to do anything because everybody recommends yeah, it. Yeah, some people yes. say you have to chew corn, eh? roasted corn, so that the rough this thing will. So the corn won't do Obi anything. Obi kasi kwedu and kakwa yeah. adre adre or ekwa master. That's what they say. That and kakwedu and my voice here that kadre ekwa master. Use the do re like the notes you no. Know. To, to go for a, co a commercial break. Hey, yeah. Sana Minya no. Mm. Okay, I'll just sing it. Okay. And Timika said, "We are on the lake. So like we, we are going for a Anyhow, you want to be. Celebrate a show and we'll be right back. Oh yeah. yeah. You're a superstar. Zero five 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 six five seven two seven eight. The phone line is activated. Zero five 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 six five seven two seven eight. Please call and talk to Yaya. Yaya, you you've been like you're an ambassador for MTN for some time. Yeah, for three years. I used to, and then why did you want to renew or? If they come again, yeah, MTN. Hey, what's up? Like, I got <laughs> you. <laughs> you, know, you know, just just call me, um, but. We, after three years, we decided to just part ways um, so I can focus on school and just do my thing. Because when it starts the future, I was in, that was before I went to school. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So the engagements were a lot and I needed focus for school. So yeah. Awards. Mm -hmm. What's your take on the current award schemes in Ghana? I think they are doing a very great mm. job and they should just keep pushing harder and um yeah making every song or artist count that's my take you've had nominations where you never you didn't win mm. some of them people said you were supposed to win mm. how, how does that make you feel when you're like you know i, I feel i've worked hard for this and then you don't 
Ooh. So on a personal okay, level, it me. feels let me, like let me take a call. Oh, okay. Hello? 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 Yes, sir. Your name and where you're calling from? My name is Isaac. Call from Antigano. Okay, Isaac. Please go ahead and talk to you. Hello? Yeah, go Hi. ahead. Hi. She's listening. Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm doing well. How about you? I'm wonderful. Great to hear your voice. Um, actually, actually, uh, where I've been, it's a little like you, you know, hearing from you. Oh, I've been around. I've, I've been cooking my album for you, and it's ready. So now you it's have, ready. yes, you have enough songs to enjoy for a while. <laughs> okay, okay. I hope you get banger. Oh, yes, you will love them. So, yes, yeah. go, go to my YouTube or iTunes, Spotify, and just type Ago Yaya, and I'll be there. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, okay, welcome. thank you very much for calling. Yes, so you're talking about that word. Yeah, time. like personally, it feels like you know disappointing, but as you said, people put in work. I mm -hmm. feel that I put in work. Another artist feels that they also put in work because that's what we all did. We put in work. So um, it gets to a point where you need to just grow out of your feelings and just deal with what's happening mm -hmm. around you. And also not um, base your confidence in your gift on ta on the awards. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Yeah. Because getting a nomination in itself is a big deal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So don't base your confidence alone on getting yeah, awards. Okay. I have another caller. Hello. Hello. Yes, sir. Yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? Your I name and why are you well, calling Mr. me? Charlie, my name is Minister Bright. I've been Minister for Church. I've been training for Church. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, okay. but I did, I did listen to Yaya in song. Pa. Oh, thank you, thank oh, yeah, you. Yeah. I, I, I did love, I did, I did love this song. Pa. Let, let me sing you. Go sing ahead, go me. ahead. Kayo, 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 Kayo. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. That was lovely. Yeah, I love you so much. I love you so much. Wow. I'll, I'll be glad. I'll be glad if I get your number, so we, we, we can have a talk. Yeah, you follow have me. To, you follow have to me on Instagram. Voice okay, okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm already following you. Hey, they sent me a DM. Ah, yeah, I mean, God bless you. You're so good. And you're not going to worship. Yeah, spiritual. Spiritual. So, I go album, no? How mm. many tracks are on it? Nine. Nine songs. Mm. Which is your favorite? All of them. <laughs> because I had so many songs that I had to pick them from. Mm. And I feel that God handpicked each song on the album. And there's a, um, a gospel song on it, Back to You. That's the last song on the album. Mm. Yes. So the inspiration behind the album, why I go? You see, someone called and said, it's been a while we, we heard from you. And I have been in a growing, um, on a growing journey. And finally, I felt that I was ready to let people know or hear my sound through a collection of work, you know, because all this while it's been singles, but you don't get to see a body of work that shows this is Yaya, a representation of who I am. So finally, I was like, I changed my name. Finally, people know me as Yaya. I've done a lot of performances around the world. I hear what I want to do. I know it. And this is what I want the world to know. Mm. So I go, it's like, here I am. Open the door for me. Wow, Make her enter. wow, wow. Yeah. So for those of us who want to enter into music, what would be the advice for us? Ooh, know what you want, most importantly. And do a lot of learning, researching. Um, if possible, find mentors um, that you you learn from, you know, because it takes a lot of hard work, a lot of learning, and as I said, knowing what you want. Mm -hmm. And also, it's a lot of money. Yes, it, it takes a lot of money to put music together, and especially if you are doing the kind of music that I do, you record live, so if you don't have a team, please, work and put some money together 
Mm. Don't just enter mm. the music like I, I want to do music. I want to do music yes, without a plan. You need a plan before you come okay, in. Okay, yes. so your final message, social media handles as we wrap I up. I love you all. Thank you so much for the love that you've shown me over the years. It's been 12 years in the industry. Mm. Yes, this year is a 12th year. So I'm really humbled and grateful that I get to share my gift with you all. I don't take it for granted. Thank you for having me. Thank you to ETV. Lorinda, I love you so much. Thank you so much for supporting Yaya. My social media handles, Yaya Official on all platforms. Please go to my YouTube, watch my videos, subscribe. Let me know you're there so I feel your energy. So watch the repeat of the Ghana series tonight right after here they spoke about the account appellations for women, the meanings and the beliefs behind it. So if you missed it in the afternoon, right after this show, we're talking about all the appellations you need to know about Tanya Brewa, Ababawa, Tetesia, Obesima. So right after here, <laughs> check that out. My name is Foster Romano. Oh, before you go, mm. my family is watching. Oh, I almost forgot. Can come, Angelica, Mr. and Mrs. Can come. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Doctor. Doctor <laughs> and Mrs. Ampersable. <laughs> Anytime I, I forget to call him See Doctor. It. If I forgot so Doctor and Mrs. Ampersable. Anytime you and you may not say it. Yen to um faithful. Send it over home. Oh, I'll be a rapper shame. Okay, to me, yeah, quick mm -hmm. chorus. Yeah. Okay, I am busy waiting for somebody. Hey. I'm not easy, uh -uh. won't give in to anybody. anybody. Uh. I am patiently <laughs> waiting for my honey. <laughs> I don't want your money. Our hearts, hearts are, are in harmony. harmony. Rap. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Hey. Oh, you're doing great. Let's go. Yeah. Aye. Yeah. Aye. Aye.